Hey, what's up guys? We are back here at Beer Banter at Highside in Old Town Fairfax. Um, yeah, it's, it's devolved. Um, we are <laughs> we're doing a uh, 40 ounce taste test today. Um, it's exciting. Yeah, I got my new, my new co-host here, uh, Maddie. How we doing? Are you sure you want to sit there? I mean, it's, it's a lot of pressure. I heard what happened to the last two. Yeah, yeah I, I thought spontaneous human combustion was a farce. Just like that. I can assure you that shit happened. <laughs> I, think I, I, had to, I had to wash that hoodie multiple times to get off all the stuff, but. <laughs> oh my God. Well, hopefully that doesn't happen to me. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, usually we, um, we have good beer. Um, Today we're trying something different. Uh, Going back to our roots. Yeah, yeah, this will remind us of like junior year of high school. Easily. Um, it's a malt liquor challenge. We have uh, a hurricane right here. It's, uh, it might be the worst. Slurricane, man. I probably haven't had one in 20 years. It's been um, solid, solid. Yeah. We got Miller High Life. I could, uh, I'm okay with that. That's the champagne of beers. Goes down smooth. Yeah. That's good. And then I think this guy's already, we're gonna deduct half a point automatically. Um, it's not a 40 ounce, it's a 42 ounce. So you really, you really get your $2.59 worth <laughs> on that guy. Also it's plastic, so uh, yeah. get a little out of control. It is, it won't like, break uh, on like our good friend Jake said, um, the type of person that's gonna buy these all the time is probably prone to dropping them. So uh, <laughs> let's just, let's, let's start. Fuck. Let's, let's start, it. let's yeah. go with it. Oh God! Hurricane. Yeah, hurricane first, I guess, right? Slurricane. We are uh, here at Highside. We're big on proper glassware, so uh, I figured these plastic cups for the uh, malt liquor. Let's just uh, I just pour them all, right? Yeah, I might as well. Just... We got we got some water for a nice palate cleanser. Cleanser. This is the only one I'm mildly. You excited about that one? I don't know. I wouldn't say excited, but I think it's going to be the lesser of three evils. This is probably the one I'm least excited about. The Fat Mouth 42 ounce. Ice house. Plastic bottle. Garbage. Oh God. All right. So we got Hurricane first. All right. Cheers. Cheers. be honest. It's not as shitty as I remember. It's not nearly as <laughs> shitty as I remember. It was kind of good, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, it's probably like, what, what is this stuff? It's just, it's like, they brew it like a lager, but they put a bunch of corn syrup and shit in it to, I don't know. I don't I don't want to speak for the Hurricane people. They're fine product. It's, it's actually not It's bad. not that bad. I mean. It's a huge possibility I'd order this at a, a bar because yeah. I drink garbage shit all the time. I'm trying to hang out, you know, the entire time. Miller Lite, that's my go-to. This is kind of like a, it's like a Miller Lite on steroids. It kind of is. Kind of. Has a little bit more of a tart taste at the end of it. Like it's been spoiled, but you know. I mean, it probably has been spoiled. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna go, uh, man, I'm gonna go 2.75. 2.75. Yeah, and I was, I was not expecting to go over a two. Uh, I'm going 2.75, man. Wasn't that bad. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to just, I'm gonna go ahead and I like my garbage drink, so I'm gonna go with a, a three. All right. Three, <laughs> three star on that All one. All right, so let me, let me, let me, let me get that. Palate cleanser, yeah. yeah. Now we're going with the champagne of beers. I mean, I could, I, I, I predisposed looking at these, I was like Miller by far, by far is gonna be the best one, but I don't know, we'll see, man. Well, that, I'm not gonna lie, I'm kind of shocked right now. I am, so far, I am. Right, it's right, been a cheers, while, brother. so. All right. all right, let's see the high life. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of funny. I think I like the Hurricane better. It doesn't taste all that different. No, the other one, I don't know. I like the other one better. I'm not tasting clouds here. That's what I expected. It said the champagne of all beers. I expected to taste clouds, I didn't taste them. I don't know, I mean, I, it, it's better than Miller Lite. Um, <laughs> I don't know about that. We're gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna break protocol here. And I'm going to go 
two and seven eighths wow. Jensen's. <laughs> We're going just above the hurricane. All right, all right. I'm, I'm still sticking true to the hurricane. And I didn't think I would do this either. Like I was convinced that this was gonna be my favorite. I'm gonna go 2.5. Your, your palate's your palate. I my think and even palette. this, this, I think the tipping point for me was it's actually considered beer. <laughs> yeah. This is a malt <laughs> beverage. I mean, would I drink it if I was broke? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what are you, so what are you going? What was your score? Mm. 2.5. 2.5. All right. Oh, palate cleanser. I don't wanna, I don't wanna do Ice House the disservice of, you know, having Miller High Life in my mouth still. All right. All right, you ready? I'm actually the most worried about this one. So am I, it's a plastic bottle. It is 42 ounces. And so. we got it from a 7-Eleven, so who knows how long it's been there. I mean, 259 is a steal for and, 42 ounces. And Fairfax as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah their 40 selection was... It was lacking. It was no bueno. Yeah, it kind of sucked. So I'm, I'm immediately, my score, keep in mind, half a point's coming off of it for being 42 ounces. Like, you think you're better than me? You're not better than me. Go fuck yourself. Do a 40 like every other fucking normal hardworking American. What the fuck? Yeah. Let's, right. let's drink this. It wow, really it really uh, doesn't taste like anything. No, it's no taste to it. It is, uh, it's 5.5%. So I thought this was gonna be the worst one. Turns out, you can't even taste it, so there's nothing to hate about it. I would put it on par with the Hurricane. So I'm gonna say, the Hurricane was 275. I gave it a three. I'm gonna go 225 because we're doing the half point deduction. Oh, uh, okay, hold for... on. Yeah, I don't really taste much, so. What are you going? We're doing the half point deduction? I, I'm doing a half point deduction. You don't have to, man. Um, let's make it a, uh, 295. You're going 295. 2.95. Are you, is that with the deduction or yeah. pre deduction? Oh man, so you would have went three, four, five before <laughs> yeah, that? 100%. Doesn't make, taste like anything. Did I make the right choice bringing you on here? What are we 100%. Doing? <laughs> All right, so we got, we do have, it's, it's not a wasted episode. We do have a real beer coming. Um, where is our, we have a Belgian quad, I believe. There it is. Thank you, sir. All right, so we got the Rio Reserva. So this is cool. It's a... Not shitty. No, it's a Belgian style quad. So it was, uh, it was brewed a very long time ago. It actually chilled in a uh, red wine barrel for two years, then chilled in a bourbon barrel for two years. So it, it, there should be a lot of complexity to this, probably low carbonation. Uh, let's see, let's get there. Give me the, we're using proper glassware again, so this one can actually go into glassware. There we go. I'm actually gonna, I'm gonna get the nose on this because there was no reason to smell the malt liquor. But I smell raisin, I smell fig. It's kind of what you expect from a quad. Absolutely. You ready to get there? Yeah, let's do it. The color is a little light though, I'm surprised. Well, well that's much better than the last three things we Yeah, unlike, unlike the first three things right now, we have, uh, I actually actual flavor. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's good. This is really good, actually. I, don't I know. like this a lot. It's it's a little light for a quad. What are we looking at on the ABV? I'm looking at 10.5, which is surprising, uh, being that it was in uh, two barrels. It didn't really taste. Normally, like normally a quad's right around you know nine and a half to ten and a half, anyways. Um, I don't know. I'm going high on this one though. The body's a little thin. The color's a little thin, but it's very, very good. Um, and I don't know, maybe maybe after drinking the, the three flavorless options, maybe, you know, the bar set a little low. senses, you know. I'm, uh, I'm going to solid four Jensen's on this thing, man. Four on this? Yeah. Okay. Where are you at? You know, usually I don't always like beers that taste like this, but um, I gotta say, I, I like it a lot. Um, I would probably agree with you. I think I'm gonna go with four as well. It's good, solid. Well I'd played, I'd recommend that sir. to anybody, for sure. Well played. Yeah. Anyways, thank you guys. Thank the literally tens of people watching this for watching this. And uh, we will be back, but come visit us at Highside in the meantime. <laughs>